John Bolton is getting read into the most sensitive intelligence we have, covert action programs, war plans, you're putting your hands over your face. What do you think about Trump making John Bolton a <clears throat> national security advisor? And more broadly, the conventional wisdom a month ago was that McMaster, Tillerson, Mattis were restraining Trump. Um, do you think that was true then? And are we in deep trouble now with Bolton and Pompeo going to state? Well, look, Tommy, you know, you, you sat in that situation room with me uh, and with the president. Um, and over eight years, we spent thousand hours in that room. The most sensitive material that is available on the planet gets discussed in that room. And I got to remind everybody why there is a thing called the National Security Advisor. The National Security Advisor started back in the 40s, but really came into its own in the Kennedy administration because he thought he was ill-served in the Cuban Missile Crisis, was to have one person who had the capacity to read in everybody, not to, not to be an editor, mm -hmm. but to say, this is Mr. President, this is what the State Department says, this is what the Defense Department, this is what the, DI, the DNI says, this is what the CIA says, this is what Defense Intelligence says, this is what, and so everybody's view is brought in on critical issues of life and death right. and national security. And I held extensive hearings as chairman of the Foreign Relations Committee when John Bolton was seeking to be nominated as the UN ambassador. And I can document for you that Bolton has two modus operandi. When he was a state, what he would do was he would shade intelligence to move it in the direction where he wanted to go. Mm -hmm. You could not, there was many instances of where him giving a not completely straightforward analysis of what the intelligence said. Secondly, anyone who disagreed with him, he tried to get rid of them. Yeah. I mean, that's in the record. And that's why Republicans joined me and defeated him, defeated him in the committee. Mm -hmm. Now, he got recess appointed right. by President uh, uh, Bush, but there was a reason for that. The single worst place in the world to have John Bolton, I mean this sincerely, yeah. is it the place where it requires somebody who will not impose their view, will make sure the president knows every perspective in his government or her government, and then will recommend to the president, Mr. President, I think state's right or I think defense is right or whatever. But it is not to cut off access. And this guy has a history of cutting off access to points of view that don't agree with his. Yeah. So it is a virtual disaster, and it's the, it is totally inconsistent with the reason why it was set up to have a national security advisor.